the yeah. quality of care once you were in once you were in the hospital and you were being uh, you were had been operated on and came around the care was phenomenal uh, the nurses were rushed or having to move quickly but um, the you never really suffered as a result of her being pushed we looked after you and gave you your medication when it was required made sure you could sit up or it transpired that all the law was supposed to only be going to be in there overnight i was going to be more dependent than they had first thought and so a home care package had to be arranged so i was actually in there for two nights um, before I could be transferred home and come into home care. The home care, um, I was really lucky in the fact that I had four visits a day. So they were constantly trying to make you do things on your own. It's part of their routine that you are self-sufficient as quickly as possible. They are not, these, are, these are not really home care assistants as such. They are actually um, people who push you, encourage you, and get you going on your own so that you're independent as quickly as possible. Uh, they're very, they're kind, but it's tough love, you know. Um, and uh, that's not a criticism. We've got to do it, and it's actually better for you. So within a couple of weeks, you're washing yourself, you're doing your own thing. The only thing that they, after that, it's food. Now, you've only got nine minutes to make you a meal. So, the, you're subtly encouraged to go on to microwave <laughs> and microwave food. Um, when I say subtly encouraged, it's a case of Yaira takers. <laughs> but um, we're really very good about it. And, uh, the, um, there are one or two firms that specialise in providing that, that type of food and once you're in the system you can actually get this type of food and um, my only problem with it was the um, sample was great but it would have been great to get a full meal you know you know um, I'm not a light eater but um, I'm not a heavy eater but even so these meals were made for indolence and I'm not I was not an invalid so anyway, we came in at lunchtime and you had lunch um, made for you and you also had the same at tea time when uh, we went to snack once again was um, persuading them that you didn't need to have lunch at half past one and your tea at half past four. You had to extend the, you had to extend the thing a wee bit and the um, once, once the mechanics were worked out, it was, it was a doddle and was really great. 